Network. TFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We had the Dow finish flat. NASDAQ down 22. S&P's also flat. Bottom line, you had a sideways market out here. Third day in a row, folks. Uh, needless to say, uh, we did hit all-time highs yesterday inside the Dow, NDX, and NASDAQ composite. Gold. Gold contract got back inside its larger range uh, today, up $9, trading at $1,492. Silver up $0.04, cents, $17.61 an ounce. Light sweet crude. We had a build of 7.4 million barrels, folks. Plenty of oil out here. Oil pulled back 68 cents, $56.55 cents a barrel. That's back under the lower swing point. That's saying, once again, oil can make the run down to that $50 level. Notes and bonds, bottom line, they went topside once again. Yesterday, what we did, you had the 10-year note, 30-year bond, go south, had big volume. That being said, though, it was still much lighter volume than we were going into. We were going into the September 13th swing low, folks. And the bottom line is that the 10-year had a million less contracts as it went into that low. What the 10-year as well as the 30-year did out here today is that they both got back inside their larger range. They shook it off. You did 1.3 million contracts in the 10-year. You're trading 129.10. You just had to get back inside 129.01. So... Tomorrow, bottom line, big day tomorrow inside the note and bond market. Why? Because you come down three days in a row. You're going after the September 13th low, which you break that low, and, you know, bottom line, you can get down to, like, that 127.21, and we're at 129 right now. Uh, what that bottom line could sit, well, right now, the way it's setting up is that it wants higher price. So tomorrow is going to be a big number. The 10-year yield right now is at 1.8%. And King Dollar, King Dollar, you know, does look like that it wants to try to get to higher price. It's laying right at the high from the swing point of last week, which is the 98.004. That's where we failed. Yesterday, King Dollar had a big day, went from 97 to 98.006. Today, bottom line, just a sideways move out here today. But when you do get a sideways move and you're staying close to the top of the range, which is that 98.004, that is saying that at least wants to get up there and see if it can hold price. Have a great night, folks. Have a safe night. Look forward to coming back here tomorrow morning. Larry Pesavento, great program. Our program starts at 9 o'clock in the morning. Have a great one, folks. Have a safe one.